The Women Friends Selina by Emma Rose Miller and Miriam Drury. I arrived in Vienna in 1916 on a steam locomotion that wound its way through the Austrian countryside with its lush hills and its pastel villages. I was just a young woman then, with only my dreams and an invitation to model for the notorious fashion salon Schwestern Flerger. I remember sitting there in the airless carriage with the windows up and the grey veil of smoke swirling past me as the train gathered speed, racing away from Tyrol, away from all I had known. To my left was a narrow corridor where people hurried back and forth in search of seats. Entschuldigen Sie bitte, they mumbled as they navigated past one another. There was a rectangular mirror opposite and a rolled up blind at the windows, racks for luggage and a glass lamp whose shade had yellowed with heat. I could hear a muffled conversation somewhere. The Russians will be pushed back from Poland by the end of the month and I bet my last krona Romania will be next. The war will be over by Christmas. You wait. I was sick of it. I rested my head against the juddering window frame and watched as the forest grew darker and my reflection became vivid in the glass. Alarmed by the dread I saw in the face that stared back at me. I was too young for all this. My family were back in the village. Too late to go back now. I was frightened. I was alone and didn't have the fare to go home. I didn't, I didn't soon enough, I supposed, in Vienna, where the streets were paved with gold and a girl's face was her fortune. Tickets, please, Fräulein. The voice shook my thoughts from me and I fumbled fretfully inside my purse until at last I pulled out a little square of pink card. I should never have left Tyrol. It was almost midnight when the train eventually came screaming into Vienna Bahnhof with its steam billowing and brakes hitting between the two white towers that flanked the main hall. I looked up as I alighted and heaved my case onto the almost empty platform up towards the arched window right at the top of one of the towers wishing he was here with me. Leon. He could have come with me on this big adventure to the city, but instead I'd probably never see him again. So begins the women friends Selina, the first of a series of novels based on Gustav Klimt's masterpiece, The Women Friends. The novellas are written by Emma Rose Miller and me, Miriam Drury, and will be published on the 1st of December by Crooked Cat. We hope to see you at our online launch party. But whether or not you can come on the day, we really hope you'll enjoy reading The Women Friends Selina. It's a finalist in the Goethe Awards.